Hey friends, in this video, I want to go over how you can make your vintage coach bag a one of a kind. This is the city bag, and as many of you know, I have five of these. This one here, I whacked off the original chain. This one here, I did not. I left the original, or not chain, strap, I'm sorry. I left the original strap on all the city bags except for this one because I wanted to have options. So I put this Keith Fawcett, Cap Fawcett strap on this bag and it completely changed the look of this bag, the look and the feel. And this bag here was made in Turkey while this one here was made in the United States. The leather is different. It's not because of the way the bag has been worn or treated. Even the hang tag on this one, you can see how, plower, how pliable this is. This leather is completely different than this leather. And the hang tag on this bag is stiffer than this hang tag. And you, as you know, these hang tags are usually never touched. You know, they're not played with or treated or any of that. And the hang tags match the leather that the bag it's attached to. Okay, this strap here, I can put on any of my bags and completely change the look. This strap here on my Willis, you can get this off eBay for less than 10 bucks. They have many different... You know, different. This is made out of the same seat belt material that seat belts is made out of, but they have them in different styles and different colors, different hardware to match your bag. This one here, and it doesn't have to be coach. This one here is a a leather Michael Kors strap, and as you can see, it completely changes the vibe on this bag. But I did not chop off the strap on this bag, and I don't believe I will. I just put this on here to show you your options. I actually use this strap on another coach bag. And the same with the Regina. The Regina. And you can also, you know, update and personalize with Twillies. The Regina didn't come with this adjustable strap. It came with a long, thin spaghetti strap. And I sometimes wear this with a chain. It completely changes the look of the bag. And this uh, Twilly here completely changed the look. You wouldn't think these bags side by side are the same, are the same style of bag. Both of these are the court bag. But as you can see, you can, uh, you know, do different things with your bags to make them look different. Uh, my, uh, lunch bag. I put a strap, or not a strap, but a chain on it, and it changes its vibe. You can even double up the chain on your bags. The convertible. You can double up, you can wear it long, or double it up as, you know, for a shoulder bag. I just wanted to, you know, make a video to show you how you can personalize your bags to make them look like one of a kind. I have a, a video coming up of some bags. I have a cap faucet bag. It's the troop tote coming. But the woman sent the crossbody. It was an honest mistake. And I'm shipping that one back and I'm getting the troop. And I also have the Party Owl leather strap coming that I'm going to be using on my bags. And this strap here actually looks really awesome on the Willis bag too. But this is the bag of the day, so that's why I uh, stuck it on this bag. But I'll show you real quick how it uh, changes the vibe on my... Uh, Willis bag. Mm -hmm. 
It's a very nice, thick, sturdy leather strap. And you don't have to, uh, you know, get a, a strap that's leather. You can get, you know, the more affordable seatbelt leather, uh, seatbelt straps. Come on, let me get this on here. All right. As you can see, it completely changes the vibe on my Willis bag. Very nice. But there you have it. That's my video for today. And hopefully at least one of the bags will come tomorrow. And, uh, you know, I got three vintage bags coming. And when they get here, I'll make a video. Stay safe and thanks for watching. Bye.